Hello chaps, we're back. Well, this episode is going to be a bit of a fucking nightmare and it's about jobs that you wish you're not going to take on but you're going to have to just out of sense of pride. So basically, I've had a lady's acquired a property and it's come with a, a steel container uh, with no keys to it, which wasn't normally a problem because normally they've got like a mortise lock, whatever on them. Uh, but she sent me pictures and you'll see in a second, it's absolutely fucking mangled. Right, well, as you've seen, <laughs> it looks like someone took a flathead screwdriver and absolutely walloped the fuck out of the lock. So the curtains fucked a lot. So we're going to get there and see how we're going to get it uh, get it open. You know what I mean? It's going to be a fucking nightmare. I've made a no promises whatsoever because it looks like it's not been open in years. Uh, I've got a few methods in my head that. So obviously, I'm probably going to have to try and drill for the stump. But even if I did that. There's no guarantee that I'll be able to retract the, the bolts, all right? So uh, another idea I've got in my head is because the keyway is that fucked, uh, taking my die grinder to it, opening the keyway up a little bit, fishing out the curtain and seeing if I can get any tension on the bolt that way. If I can get tension on the bolt and I can feel the bolt wants to move, then we're in with a shout. All right, so follow the progress and we shall see what happens. So, Ah! Yes, Charles. Well, I've got a fucking sweat on there. So, yes, victory dance. You send the victory. So, basically, I've got the. I did the lock through the keyhole, so it was a Chubb 3G115, curtain was absolutely fucking mangled, you can move it left and right with a screwdriver, uh, so I got my colleague to, use, like I said, use the die grinder, he, he grinded the keyway enough for me to push the curtain to one side, as soon as I pushed the curtain to one side and I could see the uh, bolt tail, I tested that with the um, screwdriver and I seen that there was movement in the bolts. I thought, yes, we're a fucking having this. And I also prodded each of the levers, and all levers have plenty of movement. And I thought, fucking get in there. So measured five times. Always measure more than once. Measured five times, just for the fact that the curtain was missing, so it was hard to get a precise measurement on. That's why I made it a ten mil drill hole instead of a six or an eight. Uh, so I measured, drilled through the container, got straight to the lock. Obviously, it has no wire plate because it's a three G one one five rather than the one one four straight into the lock, sin the fucking stump, sin the levers, lifted it up, boom, slid it back, looked like a fucking boss. And there you go, guys, thinking outside the box. It's what being the locksmith's all about. Yeah!